Kitchen. Today we'll be doing a flat rice noodle in thick gravy. So here I have 500 grams of fresh flat rice noodle that I have loosened and separated so that they will not clump together when we fry it. And here I have one bunch of kailan that I have chopped up into 3 cm lengths. And here I have 150 grams of beef rum steak thinly sliced, seasoned with half a teaspoon of salt and pepper and one teaspoon of cornstarch. Here I have a bunch of coriander chopped, half a teaspoon of pepper, half a teaspoon of sugar, four cloves of garlic roughly chopped, one and a half tablespoon of light soy sauce, one tablespoon of fish sauce and three tablespoons of cornstarch that we will mix with two tablespoons of water later just before we put into the sauce and we will need 800 ml of water up two tablespoons of cooking oil and once it's hot when the oil is shimmering and you can see starting to smoke at the rice noodle do not touch it for 2 minutes before you cross it. After 2 minutes, we cross it. And leave it for another 2 minutes. So you have to let it cook for Two minutes before you cross the next one. This is so that it can char some parts of the noodle. Okay, so the next two minutes, we turn it. The two is more short now. Okay. Leave it for two minutes. The two minutes is up, we can reach it up here. Now you can set aside and keep it warm. One tablespoon of oil, then when you start to smoke like this, very hot already, you add in the garlic. And stir it and once it's aromatic you can add in the beef separate the beef make sure that it's not come together and stir it to make sure that it's The color has changed. The beef is color turned brown. You can add in the pepper, the soy sauce, the fish sauce. And bring it to a ball. In the ball, you can add in the vegetable and let it braise for two minutes. Raising, add two tablespoons of water into the cornstarch. Make sure you stir to dissolve all the 
the starch before you put it into the bread. and then keep stirring until the sauce thickens once you have let it simmer and stir until the sauce thickens you can turn off the heat then arrange the noodles in onto a plate and you can scoop the sauce over the noodles <laughs> 